A nationwide cyber attack hits home. It has crippled the operations of a healthcare giant as it battles the coronavirus pandemic. Greg Argos has the details. It could be one of the largest cybersecurity breaches in U.S. history. It seems like it's a ransomware attack. And it targeted computers of a major hospital system based out of King of Prussia. It has infected the, uh, the network that's run by the hospital system with, a, uh, with code that, that essentially locks up uh, your, your databases. This weekend, Universal Health Services, which operates more than 400 locations, most in the U.S., including six behavioral health centers and clinics in our region, started seeing the telltale signs of an attack. This is, it prevents access to your data and to your applications and to the use of the network. Rob DeVideo, a Drexel professor and cybersecurity expert, says this attack could have life or death implications. Medical professionals don't have access to test results that they're waiting to come back, don't have access to, uh, you know, which drugs that uh, and, and which medications people in the hospital uh, need to be taking and on which schedules. So this can really have an impact. DeVideo says this cyber attack could, of course, be dangerous for some patients, but it could be very costly for Universal Health Services Incorporated, which could shell out a lot of money to get their data back. We're talking hundreds of thousands of dollars. UHS has not formally acknowledged the breach, simply releasing this statement on their website, quote, the IT network across Universal Health Services, UHS facilities, is currently offline due to an IT security issue. It continues, no patient or employee data appears to have been accessed, copied, or misused. Even so, DeVideo says this should be a learning lesson for everyone when it comes to Internet safety. Organizations want to make sure they have business continuity plans in place. You and I want to make sure that we have, even on our home computers, we have a good backup plan in place. In King of Prussia, Greg Argos, CBS3 Eyewitness News.